Henry Ford's greatest innovation wasn't the automobile. It was teamwork. Because he knew to accomplish something great, it could not be a solo venture. And nowhere else is that better embodied than in the hospital that shares his name. In the city that he helped grow. And as he recruited great doctors and nurses from across the country, he was putting the world on notice. In the city and with the people who build the best cars, we also will provide them the very best care. And as a team, they found the sickest of the sick and treated those sicknesses together. Because to them, the opponent wasn't the doctor down the hall. It was the disease found in the child sitting in her bed down the street in Detroit, where it was most needed. It was their job to help those who had no answers, to research, treat, and then treat even better. But they did so together. After 1967, when Detroit was abandoned, one name didn't stray. The city needed an anchor. It found a friend. And over time, Detroit and its hospital grew closer. This meant traveling beyond the walls of Henry Ford Hospital and into the neighborhoods, treating, teaching, and touching, and all of it together. A century of not just being there, improving the community we are a part of, because it would be a crime not to, giving hope to the hopeless, being an engine for change, encouraging others to do the same, wherever, whenever. As the hospital evolved, became a system and employed thousands inside and outside Detroit, one thing stayed true. Henry Ford was a part of this city and would never leave because they were in this together. In fact, it would grow beyond 2799 West Grand. This bastion of medicine would actively serve and care for even more of our city, transforming lives, rebuilding communities, one patient and one neighborhood at a time, with sustainable investments that held true to the vision. Just like it all began with a founder who demanded that those who serve here would never settle for good enough, the men and women who make up the fabric of Henry Ford Hospital live, breathe, and care for the city in ways that go far beyond the balance sheet. We are a national model for how hospitals and communities should work together. Because these aren't just patients, they're our neighbors. And these communities, they are our communities. Moving into a new century, even greater achievements await. With help from others inside and outside Detroit, we can create a beautiful tapestry again for both our city and its hospital. This will not be done alone, but together we can. Mm -hmm.